Over the U.S., President Donald Trump announced emergency countermeasures to combat the virus. These include travel ban as well as financial relief to workers affected by the outbreak. Kim ji tells us more. U.S. President Donald Trump's countermeasures unveiled on Wednesday include a 30-day travel ban from Europe to the U.S. starting Friday. He added the United Kingdom is exempt from the travel restrictions. The Department for Homeland Security said they would only apply to foreign nationals, not to American citizens or legal permanent residents. Regarding South Korea and China, President Trump said the U.S. will keep monitoring the situation and reevaluate current restrictions and warnings if conditions improve. Passengers flying from South Korea to the U.S. are currently required to participate in medical checkups, namely having their body temperature checked before boarding. Direct flights from China to the U.S. are banned. President Trump also announced economic measures that would help the U.S. overcome what he called temporary economic disruptions caused by the coronavirus. These measures include financial relief for American workers through payroll tax cuts for three months, for which he asked Congress for approval, as well as low-interest loans for small businesses. I am instructing the Small Business Administration to exercise available authority to provide capital and liquidity to firms affected by the coronavirus. This action will provide more than $200 billion of additional liquidity to the economy. The Washington Post reported Wednesday the number of confirmed cases in the U.S. has surpassed 1,300. Kim Jian, Arirang News.